from the hood youtube this is crazy samurai so you want to hear a brand new another video so one of the things that i haven't been talking about as much as i probably should have but it's okay now I, i'll just talk to you guys a little bit about this um as many people know uh common rider ended their series um the recent series of common rider drive now they're on to common rider ghost which is the 45th um series of common rider and i'll tell you this much right now i love it it's a great show, really cool concept. I love the whole entire icons and how they're related to like different um, historical figures, whether they be good guys or bad guys. And you may be wondering what that means. Well, there's people that are like, and when I say historical, I mean it could be someone like Mozart, could be someone like Al Capone, could be Billy the Kid, could be, and you know, so there's uh, mythology and then there's re realistic, there's real people and then there's people that are like, talked about a lot you know um i said mozart there's beethoven even uh i'm trying to think what else there is uh you know there's a lot of variation there's some like uh historic japanese uh characters in, in uh you know in uh mythology and all that you know there's a whole variety of characters in the, and those characters are based on uh like determine the ability that a certain character will have there's robin hood even uh, you know, there's a, there's a whole variety of characters and, like, the weapons are determined by that. And, um, you know, there's just been a lot. Oh, yeah, there's been Thomas Edison. Um, you know, I'm just thinking of them. Like, there's a lot of different characters, and it's just really cool um, that they decided to use that as their, like, you know, their concept. Um, so one of the other things, obviously, is the other, which is always key when it comes to common Rider seasons in general, are the other riders other than the main one. So currently, so, you know, the main one's Ghost, but then the one that we got recently was Spectre. Then, very recently, we just found out about information about our a third rider, a third rider, which is pretty awesome, pretty awesome. Uh, as many people know, last season we did not get three riders and typically don't get three riders. Uh, two, three riders is usually uncommon. Um, usually, if we get three riders, it's usually three riders alongside a bunch of others. Uh, and if you're wondering where I'm referring to, I'm referring to Gaim, or I'm referring to Wizard, even. Because Wizard actually had a bunch of riders. Though, there were really only two that were significant. Well, and when I say significant for, for uh, Wizard, I'm, I mean, like, actually had a. Like, you know they were in so many episodes i'm referring to beast and wizard i'm I, like the other riders from that season were definitely like known and they definitely made an appearance that was important but none of them were anywhere near as uh anywhere near as like um involved or appeared in as many episodes as the two of them the two of them sh show up in more episodes than any other r rider from that season um but our new rider, which I keep on going on and on, is Kamen Rider Necrom. Now, I probably will show an image at this point, and I'll tell you this much right now. He looks really, really cool. I like his look. He's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Um, you know, Kamen Rider Necrom is a, a pretty interesting... He has a pretty interesting look. You know, he he definitely has that, that look of, um, you know like he would have a hood but at the same time he has the one horn and if you're curious why i'm mentioning the horns i recently heard this whole discussion about how you know um some of them have you know how the riders have horns or whatever and um it's interesting to to note that because you know not every right um because of the fact that uh what do you just hold on one second guys um because it seems that all three of these riders have different no numbers of horns, and uh, yeah, I just want to make sure that was right. Okay, um, for example, Common Rider Ghost has one horn, right in the middle. Common Rider um, Specter has uh, well, Specter has two horns, one on each side, and um, Necrom has one in the middle. Now, one thing that people have been describing him to look very similar to is, is is he looks very similar to a combination of what Ghost looks like and what Fize looks like. And if you're curious who Fize is, Fize was from a different season, and I totally see it. One thing that also is interesting is that unlike Ghost and, um, and Spectre, 
apparently it looks like Necrom's, um, you know, driver is supposed to be based in his arm, which isn't always that common to see. Though I'm curious if it's just arm or if it's arm plus belt, like similar to, uh, um, you know, a season like Drive where they had like the whole entire, you put the car in and you revved it up and then you, and then you like moved it to the driver and then the driver like activated it. Like that would be kind of interesting to see if they're going to do something similar to that or if, if it's purely based in the arm. If it's purely based in the arm, it's pretty interesting because, you know, um, Kamen Rider in general is like the way that they you know henshin in other words transform is through their belts it's it's rare that we see it specifically only through their arms if it's through their arms it's through their arms plus another plus plus their belts like their arms start and then their belts continue it it's usually not just their arms that's kind of how um common writers always been that's one of the things that if you know Kamen Rider that's very very common when people think of Kamen Rider you're not thinking of um, braces or wristbands or any of that other stuff you're thinking of drivers or belts in other words um, so he has a very cool look I like the combination of like this whitish greenish um, well it's really just like a it's, it, yeah it's a greenish look that but it's like really cool looking and it, it has like this really menacing feel to it and i'm just kind of i love it i really do love it i think it's one of the best looking things ever so we have a red looking one uh a blue and a green and it's cool uh you know for riders and it's just kind of i just like it a lot and i think that he in general has this really really awesome look that stands out um, from the other two which they have very solid appearances while his is more you know it, it looks kind of like there's a lot more detailing that makes it a little bit more exciting and a little bit more interesting i mean i love ghosts and i love specter's looks but i think that like i, I just really think that necron looks awesome and i'm really excited to see how he's going to be introduced and um who is he supposed to be i'm curious if possibly he's the one that's been associated with specter recently in the show you know the you know the guy with like the long with like the blondish hair which he looks super familiar i'm forgetting what he's been in because i totally recognize him he's like the one that typically communicates with specter at different points in the show he's not the one that like has the other icons he's the that other guy that like wants him that wants specter to work with him or whatever um so yeah i mean those, just in general i'm curious to see how that's going to work out and um i'm really looking i really am enjoying common rider ghost and uh it's been a great show and it's really really cool and uh you know i'm liking it and it has these feelings towards you know being similar to gaim in some ways being similar to drive in some ways being similar to a bunch of different seasons one of the big ones is is, is gaim it, it definitely has a gaim like feel to an extent and i just kind of like it like it's pretty cool and just in general i think that it's been a real i think that so far it's been a really fun and interesting season and I can't wait to keep on watching it, and I can't wait to see how Necrom will be introduced and uh, what Necrom will play as a part in the show. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, again, this has been Crazy Samurai 71, so bye-bye, guys.